So did Tencent just crack the code for making AI think more like us? Today, we're diving into this really fascinating new approach they call parallel thinking. The idea is to teach AI models to explore a whole bunch of solutions at once, instead of just getting stuck on one single path. And honestly, this could be a huge leap forward. But first, think about it for a second. When you're up against a really tough problem, what do you do? You brainstorm, right? You weigh different options, you look at it from a bunch of different angles, and then you pick what seems like the best path forward. Well, what if AI could do that too? That's the big idea we're going to unpack today. To really get why this parallel thinking thing is such a big deal, we've got to look at how most AI models are thinking right now. And, well, they kind of have a one-track mind. The standard method out there is called chain of thought. It's logical. It's straightforward. You know, the AI starts at step one, goes to step two, then three, and just keeps going in a straight line until it hits an answer. I mean, this is the dominant technique used by pretty much all the major language models you've heard of. But here's the catch, and this quote just nails it. It's a fragile system. If the AI makes one little mistake early on, the entire thing is doomed. There's no going back, no second guessing, the whole structure just comes crashing down. So where does this fragility really cause problems? Well, it's in the high stakes stuff where you have to be precise. Think complex math problems, tricky logic puzzles, and yeah, coding tasks. In these areas, one tiny error at the start, like a misplaced number or a flawed step, means the final answer is going to be completely, totally wrong. But what if there was a better way? This brings us to the solution that Tencent's research is proposing, an approach that feels a lot more like how we humans tackle things, by exploring all sorts of possibilities. And this slide just lays it out perfectly. On the left, you've got the old way, that single narrow path. But on the right, you've got parallel thinking, where the AI is generating and checking out multiple lines of reasoning all at the same time. It's the difference between walking a tightrope and getting to explore a wide open field. Honestly, the best way to wrap your head around this is to think of a good old-fashioned brainstorming session. Instead of just locking into the first idea, the AI comes up with a whole portfolio of different solutions. Then it looks them over, checks its work, and picks the one that seems the most solid. So, this all sounds great in theory, but how in the world do you actually teach an AI to think this way? It's not like you can just flip a switch and tell it to be more creative. Tencent came up with a really clever, multi-stage training process. Let's break it down. The whole process has five key stages. First, they use reinforcement learning, basically giving the AI a reward for exploring effectively. Second, it gets a cold start, which just means it practices on easy problems to learn the ropes. Third, they ramp up the difficulty with a progressive curriculum. The fourth step is really smart. It alternates the rewards, pushing the AI to value both accuracy and diverse thinking, so it doesn't get stuck in a rut. And finally, the model learns to shift from just exploring to actually verifying its own answers to find the absolute best path. Okay, that's the theory. A five-step training process sounds impressive, but did it actually lead to better performance? The results are in, and well, they're pretty jaw-dropping. This is the moment of truth, right? After all that complicated training, did Tencent's model actually deliver on its big promise? Oh yeah, it absolutely did. On a notoriously difficult math reasoning test, the new model showed a performance boost of a whopping 42.9% over the standard model. That is not a small improvement. That is a fundamental leap. And here's what that number actually looks like. On this chart, we've set the baseline model's performance at 100. As you can see, the parallel R1 model just soars right past it. It really shows you how significant this jump in reasoning ability actually is. So, a nearly 43% improvement on a math test is great. But let's talk about the bigger picture. Why should we care about this outside of a research lab? Well, this breakthrough matters for some really important reasons. This approach really gives us three key benefits. First, higher accuracy, which means a more reliable AI we can actually trust with important stuff. Second, it's a path toward greater efficiency, making AI smarter, not just bigger and more power hungry. And finally, it's a big step toward a more human-like way of thinking, which for a lot of people is the ultimate goal. Now, just let your imagination run with this for a minute. Think about financial models that could explore multiple risk strategies all at once or an AI coding buddy that debugs your code by trying several different fixes simultaneously. You could even have creative AIs that draft multiple storylines and then weave the best parts together. The possibilities are just huge. Of course, let's keep our feet on the ground. It's not a perfect solution just yet. 
Exploring all those different paths, well, that naturally takes more computational power than just following one. And designing that sophisticated reward system, getting that balance between exploration and accuracy just right, is a really complex art. So there are definitely still hurdles to clear. So that leaves us with the big question. Is parallel thinking the missing piece of the puzzle that's going to finally unlock truly human-like reasoning in AI? Or is it another incredibly important but still incremental step on a much longer journey? The answer isn't clear yet, but one thing is for sure, the path forward for AI just got a whole lot wider.